you've overslept past your alarm, and the world outside remains quiet, with the birds chirping and the neighborhood calm. However, as you enter your car, a touch of sunlight welcomes you, introducing the new Volvo X90, taking the luxury car experience to new heights by illuminating the vehicle's interior with nearly sunlight quality, courtesy of a comprehensive set of 72 sun-like LEDs. The mission at Volvo Cars is really to create beautiful cars that are desirable to our, our customers, really designed and executed to the true values of Volvo. We have a fantastic history in safety. We're also very focused on sustainability and human-centric designs. The idea of being human-centric is really about not focusing on just the product itself. We really see the car as something which is there to help to enhance people's lives. So we always really try to focus back on what it is that we're trying to do for people. And that's really the, the foundation of being human-centric. For us, electrification was really at the heart of the EX90, and we understand that electrification isn't just changing the engine to an electric motor. It's really about a paradigm shift. It's about the connectivity. It's about really increasing the intelligence of the car, the fact that it can protect you in ways that it couldn't before, the fact that taking away the engine kind of liberates more space for people, and then obviously the kind of very uh, close connection to sustainability as well. So we really saw it as much more than just making an electric car. The X90 is one of the safest cars for a number of reasons, but the one that really stands out to me is the LiDAR. Now the LiDAR is a technology that we've integrated into our car, and the whole point of a LiDAR is to actually see. By putting it up high, you see out as far as possible, even at nighttime, beyond what a human can see. The things that drive me most as a designer is really around perfection and answering what a customer need is or the use case around a product. That was a real focus on the EX90. To create that premium perception and really that usable state of a car, every little detail matters. Everything laid out here is just some of the examples of the development of the EX90. I think here at Volvo we go through a process of development that is quite complex of all the attributes that we have to integrate into design work. It's not just a single item that we focus, we focus on everything as a team, whether it's R&D development, design, testing through safety and whatnot. I feel genuinely lucky to be able to do a career that I feel very passionate about. The team that I work with, they motivate me too to really work together and make the best out of design. We had a lot of different inspiration. It was music, art, Scandinavian homes and the nature. And I think also from fashion we got a lot of inspiration. It's about respecting the properties yes. in the natural material, finding their limits and being able to create something that really celebrates those properties. What really motivates me is to create the best user experience ever seen in any car and really to support all the material development that you guys are putting your effort into. I think what drives me is the way design influences our emotions and that we can use design to create stories and touch the users. Well, all of these speakers that we have in the vehicle, they're put there with a purpose. It's really a purpose of bringing you the best immersive sound that you can get. Also tuned for you, it's tuned for every seat. To see the vast amount of detailing that goes into making up one vehicle is a bit eye-opening. There are quite a number of challenges on the EX90 in development, and I think without challenges you don't innovate. Those areas where we really challenge each other, where we challenge the development, we challenge the process of how we do things, I think that's the most exciting part of the job. What drives the team to develop great design is this whole passion. It's taking that idea from a first sketch, working it into a feasible proposal, and then really holding on to that as you develop with the engineering teams, with the project teams, to a point that we have something that we're all proud of. The EX90 is the first Volvo car that uses the sun-like technology. For me, it's a milestone in Volvo car's history. These are some of the interior lighting parts that we see here. What we did here was we picked a really, really unique LED. Uh, it's called the sun-like LED. Uh, and it's made in a special way, it uses a different, or a unique ship. It has a unique phosphor coating. And it really replicates the natural spectrum of sunlight. And this is really cool because it really brings out the vividness and the natural colors of all materials. Textiles, wood, your skin tone. So it really brings out everything and it makes it look really, really amazing compared to conventional LEDs and conventional luminaires. So it makes it really comfortable to the eyes? Yeah. 
The whole idea was to get uh, the user closer to a natural environment. Natural light has been a part of our evolution. We have been programmed by sunlight, so this is very close to us. The sunlight technology is uh, one good contributor to safe driving because the spectrum is replicating the natural sunlight and uh, really gives a very comfort feeling to your eyes. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe for more car reviews and updates. See you in the next video.